All right, I had to turn all the chargers, dischargers, AC off, and the inverter off because it gets pretty loud in here, but I got something special for you guys today. I'm gonna share my secret with you. And that's how I get these big batteries, these lithium iron phosphate batteries or lithium packs or any of these good deals that I review without having to haggle with the manufacturer at all. There's a website that you can get very deep discounts on all this stuff and I'm gonna share it with you on Tackle That. All right, first let's start with an unboxing. I wanna get this thing up and running because we have a storm coming. So this is gonna be another 48 volt battery that we're gonna run in parallel on our home solar system that we do, so we don't have to balance any cells in series. They all just are gonna bolt up to the bus bar that we have and they'll all run in parallel. So they'll all discharge and charge at the same time. And the internal BMS will manage all 16 cells that are inside in each one of the packs. So we shouldn't have to worry about um, any uh, variances in voltage between the packs. Now, if you have a question with that, it is, it is common. If you check out off-grid garage australia the guy goes through a lot of tests and that in uh, where he runs batteries in parallel and discharges them and charges them all at the same time and he didn't have any issues the the pack as a whole uh, will have the capacity of all the batteries put together and it really is um, an easy way to connect your batteries up and he goes into all the science and all the testing on how that is still a viable option for you. All right, so without further ado, let's open this guy up and we're gonna charge her up and then give her a test. By the way, this 50 amp hour, 48 volt battery, which is normally maybe five or $600, was only $221 on this website that I'm gonna share with you at the end. I know it's a cliffhanger, I don't like doing it either, but you know what, we need to work on the YouTube algorithm so this information can get out to more people and they can get these great deals as well. <clears throat> All right, let's take out the Swiss Army knife and open this bad boy up. All right, we got some good packing. Oh, all right. Oh. Plastic wrap. And there she is. So this is a Lithova LFP 48 volt 50 ST, so that stands for 50 amp hours. So this is gonna have 2,560 watt hours of, pa of battery power. It looks a lot like the other 200 amp hour battery that I have, same case and everything, but that's a 12 volt battery. So essentially just think of it this way. Instead of having a really large 12 volt battery, they have four 12 volt batteries in this case, but with a little bit smaller capacity. So 50 amp hours, 50 amp hours, 50 amp hours, 50 amp hours, ran in series, will give you 48 volts at 50 amp hours. And that is great because when we're talking about managing all your cells, the BMS in here will regulate the power going out, the power going in, and making sure all 16 of those cells will stay perfectly balanced. All right, first thing I like to do is test the voltage and see kind of what they ship it at. And this is going to be, let's see, 52.9 volts, 52.9 volts. So that's actually pretty good. It's in the higher side of the range. So you're not gonna have to put a lot of power into this just to get it off the ground. All right, let's connect her up to the charger. All right, got my 48 volt charger. Now make sure you're getting a lithium iron phosphate charger. This is gonna charge at eight amps 
and 58.4 volts. That's the um, max voltage for these cells and you want to match up the right charger with the right chemistry. All right guys, the light is green. We are good to go. Let's go ahead and add this to the solar battery bank so we can start uh, reaping the rewards of this extra power since we got that storm coming. Ugh. All right, we'll put this here for now. A little temporary in our uh, home solar setup, but right next to all the other 48 volt batteries, we'll run it right to these bus bars into our inverter and we'll be good to go here shortly. Okay, we've got our breaker added. I'm not gonna be pulling more than 50 amps out of these batteries, so I have a 60 amp breaker. And uh, something I do wanna let you guys know, when you're connecting a battery up to an existing bank, you need the voltages to be very similar. They can be 0.1 volt off, and that way energy doesn't rush from one pack into the other tripping your BMSs and causing problems, heating up your wires, that kind of stuff. So what we have is a solar power bank that is almost charged and there is energy flowing into these batteries already, charging them up. And then this one is charged up, uh, but it is uh, has settled a little bit. So the voltages are very similar. And then since it's on charge, the solar panels are gonna be charging these up and it's not really gonna get a lot of power from this. And we're gonna use a clamp meter to test my hypothesis on this. So let's go ahead and get these wired up. And you always want to have your breaker disconnected when you're connecting everything up. Let's put these behind these other wires like this. Like this. All right, so nothing's connected yet because my breaker is still disconnected. Let's get these nuts and washers on here. We got 53.9 volts on the battery and we have 53.8 volts on this pack so almost perfect i'm not worried about much here but let's zero this out we're all connected let me tighten these guys up all right and just like that let's put a meter on this wire zero it out and we'll flip her on and we'll see. All right, so we got current flowing through the connection, but it's only about one amp. So that is perfect. That means these are pretty balanced and energy is not surging going in one from into the other. And uh, that's it guys. We've added this 50 amp hours to the 200 amp hour existing pack, giving us 25% more just like that. Now, since you guys have waited till the end of the video, thank you so much. The coupon code and the website I get these batteries is down in the description. It's called My Vipon, almost like coupon, almost like VIP put together. But a lot of times this website has manufacturers that want to get their products out, especially with these new brand batteries. And they're giving heavy discounts, 50% off, 70% off for you to try the battery out. And they hope that you will review and, and take some pictures and leave, make some videos just like this, right? So uh, check out that website. There's a link in the descri description. It will give me a little referral, I think. I'm not sure if it actually pays out or anything, just trying it out. But 
Your help and your support is awesome. I appreciate it. You guys are amazing. You keep me going. So thanks again for tuning in. This battery is just a great deal. $221 for 50 amp hours at 48 volts is unheard of. Get yours today, guys. Talk to you on the next one.